Hello the YouTube, this is a segment I'll be starting on how to use Microsoft Office tools. Um, today I'll be showing you PowerPoint. Um, this is one of the simplest ones you can get from Microsoft Office and it takes no hassle on us. Now I have got um, Microsoft Office 2007, but for this tutorial I'll use 2003 since most people tend to have that. If you'd like a 2007 one, send me a message and I'll do that. Okay, so first of all you've got this blank screen, so I'll zoom out so you can see it. And I don't want these boxes here, I want to make my own titles. If you want to make your own title, just click that box and just type in whatever title you wanted. And then you can just write in by Jim Bar. I don't know, I'm just making this up. So you can just do it like that. That's the old boring way to do it. Now the fun way would be to delete these boxes here, like so. And make it a bit more catchy. So you go down to this A here for word art. And I'll recommend this one at the top, just the plain one. And you can type in what you want. So I'll just type in hello. Type with one hand there. And click OK. And then you can edit it like this. So you go to right click, format word art, colours and lines by here, colour, fill effects, two colour, more colours, and I'm gonna do a quite a funky one with a red. And on this one, I'm going to choose an orange. So they blend like this. And when you press OK, and OK again, it blends like this. So that's quite a nice color. And then you can edit that in any way you want with like custom animations for everything. So if you wanted it to do an enter, you are sure to do that now. So when you start your slideshow, it'll look like this. And then that'll be the end of your show, yeah? Well, if you want to make it more catchy, you can just add an animation to it. So you right click, custom animation, over to the right hand side here, add effect, entrance, fly in, and I'll just choose a random one, like zoom, and then I can do an emphasis, do a spin, and then exit, I'll do a fly out. Okay, so now, when you start your show, You click, hello, you click again, it spins, click again and it flies away. Okay, so that just makes it a bit more catchy. Now, the background's a bit white and plain, as you may have noticed by now, and I'll show you the change of that. So you'd right click on your background, go to background, obviously, then you drop down this little bar, and I'm going to do fill effects again, and I'm going to go to colour again. So, I pick colour like blue, and just, and like, this beigey bluey colour, I can't really explain that colour and I click OK but what before I do this I'll actually show you something else um, let me just do that again, so this is just a recap again if you want to look at it two colours, more colours, I'm going to go blue and this beige colour and then down here you got your options of which way it's going to look so you can have it like this all these different ones and I'm just going to do it horizontal for now and click OK. Now, if you want to just stay on this one slide, you can apply. If you want it to um, go through every slide, you can apply to all, which I do. So, apply to all. Okay, now you've got this cool blue background. And I suppose you'd want a uh, new slide. So, you'd go to Insert, New Slide. And here's this slide by here. Now, you've got your options of what type of slide you want over here. You can either just delete any th like things and custom it yourself, or you can just do these content layouts by here and I just choose a blank one so now I'd go to um, word arts let's suppose and do this and just say bye okay now you can do many things with this so I'm just gonna do format word art um let's see now let's go for um another fill effect with a preset color and the and these come with a few so ocean's quite a nice one but that would probably blend with the background, so I'll we'll try another one. Uh, how about early sunset? That looks okay. Just try that, and there it is there. And then you can add subtitles by just going down. Like you would on Word, you can have a text box and drag it open. And then you can type in, um, hello, and goodbye. Typing with one hand is quite hard. Before. Okay. Now... For typing words, there's different effects you can do. So you'd highlight it, right click, custom animation, add effect. Now there's one that I quite like that only available for type it out words. 
not word art words, so it's called swish. So when you type it in, I'll put it on very fast, and then they drop in like this. All right, and then I can have that on an exit, so it's just um, checkerboard out. Okay, so I've just made a two slide presentation. So I'll press F5 to start the slide, click for once. Hello, spin. Then it drops away. Next slide, bye. Then you can have hello and bye pop up there. Click that, fades away. There's your end of your show. There's some basic things. I'll move on to stuff like hyperlinks in my next video. And if you want anything else, any help you need, just tell me and I'll sort that out for you. So thanks for watching this video. See you next time on Technology Info.